Hi folks, this is Max from uh, RootGalaxyNote.com. So I've got ROM of the Week for your AT&T Galaxy Note uh, SGH i717, or if you have the i717M, uh, any of the Canadian versions starting with SGH i717. This is an AOC, AOCP, the Collective uh, ROM. By the Collective team, a very solid ROM. It's built for just for this phone on this version. Uh, that is why it's cool, and uh, it should make your AT&T uh, Galaxy Note fly. Um, also it does come with an uh, overclockable kernel uh, and full Android 4.2.2 and it's kind of a um, modded version of CM 10.1 uh, but this is built off the sources. Um, should give you pretty good uh, battery life and performance. Um, to enable the performance may you go make sure you go to about phone and hit the build number until it says uh, you're a developer and then you'll be able to see performance options uh, where you can overclock up to uh, 1.836 uh, I don't actually recommend it my recommendation uh, just run it at stock 1.5 uh, because this ROM is pretty fast enough uh, you get all these uh, governors my favorites are Wheatley, uh, Lulz Active those two are actually pretty good with battery and performance um, and uh, let me show you the keyboard also you can see it's instead of the blue usual blue theme with the AOSP ROMs this one has a kind of an orange theme uh, which I kinda like it and also you do get the yellow and gray keyboard a uh, very nice very nice job and also if you have a uh, Google now is not working or something just go to the Play Store um, just do a search for Google Vo uh, Google search and update it and it will work out of the box um, so that's how you fix that that's just an issue with uh, whoops. Let's go to update here. That's just an issue with the latest G apps. It's a bug, but you can simply fix it by downloading the Google Search app, uh, and you should be able to get Google Now working flawless. Uh, let me show you that real quick here on the go. Updating Google Search, and it should be working now. Nope, there we go. Give it a second. It's still installing. Uh, installed. San Francisco Giant score. There you go, now it's working fine. Um, so there you go. Uh, other than that, you do get pretty much the same settings from uh, Cyanogen Mod. Um, you can get screen security, button action, slider shortcuts. Um, you know, it's not the most customizable ROM, uh, I have to admit, but it is a very stable ROM that you can run made um, just for this phone. Um, there are other versions, I think, for Infuse or something, but. Uh, for this one, it's for this phone. And also you can customize all of those things if you want. Uh, but very nice ROM. Check it out for this week's ROM of the Week, uh, AOC, AOCP, the collective ROM, um, the Android Open Collective Project. That's what it's called. And don't forget to donate to the developers of this ROM. They work very hard on this uh, ROMs if you like the ROM. And also there's an app called uh, Quiet Time that comes with it. Um, and also clock, uh, that's just a regular clock. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching this video. If you have a Galaxy Note, uh, AT&T Galaxy Note or Note 10.1, don't forget to sign up for my email list at rootgalaxynote.com. And also Note 2 is over at uh, galaxynote2root.com. And uh, if you like this video, as always, don't forget to hit that like button here, subscribe button down there. And I'll see you guys later. Stay high on Android. Uh, have a great week, folks. Love. Oh, let's check out the wallpapers real quick. Uh, the AOCP wallpapers, AOCP wallpapers. Um, so here's more AOC, AOCP wallpapers. So it's hard to say it for, <laughs> it's hard for me to say it because I'm usually uh, saying AOSP, AOSCP. There is a ton of great wallpapers. Anyway, see y'all later. Have a great day.